my gender doesn't define my style because style is like clothing and what you put on and it's literally just like fabric and thread and like makeup is just cream and powder like those things don't have a gender to them my style is defined by who i am but who i am is not defined by my gender i got into makeup through drag and then i went on instagram and i saw like that there were actually a community of boys who did makeup and i saw that and i was like damn like they look good and i tried it one day and i was like damn i look good i think instagram's a really good platform especially for me because it's like a sort of portfolio in a way this was a present from two dear friends and we had a cabaret night at school and they asked for performers and I did drag for it. It was my first time like publicly doing like a drag performance like on my own. That like, cabaret night was definitely what I needed at the time. I was feeling like really not confident because like new school, everything. And I did this and everyone was like, damn, like he can actually perform. <laughs> school plays are always like the highlight of my year, I think. And now like I'm working on putting on like our own school play, which is a stress, but I'm loving it. I think my biggest inspiration at the moment is Bowie. Like just his attitude and his style. And I'm also really inspired by punk and the whole punk movement. Like Vivian Westwood is a massive inspiration to me. So I'll get like comments in public, like people who will like come off trains to, like they'll literally follow me off trains to like harass me and call me like a fag and all these things. Expressing yourself is 100% easier than it's ever been. Like, go back even 10 years and I would not be going into school looking the way I do. Like, wearing heels into school, wearing eye makeup, wearing... Just having my hair like this. And men in makeup? Absolutely not. Men in women's clothing? Absolutely not. I'm just so privileged to be able to live where I am in the world, when I am, and around the people that I'm with. Like. I could not honestly ask for a more like supportive community. There was a little boy once who came up to me from like my old primary school and he was like, are you wearing eyeliner? And I was like, yes. And he just said, that's cool. And I was really taken aback. This is just me like being myself and it's maybe doing good for other people. Like, of course it's important to like be yourself, but when being yourself actually helps other people, that's incredibly like rewarding and just like an amazing feeling. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.